welcome to Find Your Flow Fashion Maneuvers class. Happy 11 11, November 11, 2024, step 20 day. How you guys feeling today? We're about to move our fascia and to feel good. And most importantly, let's celebrate 11 11. <laughs> How you guys feeling today? Type in the comment, type your mood and your intention <laughs> that you bring into this life. And also, today is a very powerful day obviously we're gonna work on some you know setting some intentions and if you already worked on you know working on your drawing board whatever you want to manifest for this new year and new me <laughs> how are you guys feeling very happy you guys are here hello from poland good oh that's awesome excited to be here live yeah i am very excited to be here uh to move fascia with you guys on this special day 11 11 hi hello very oh human garage seattle <laughs> yes here to work yes amazing yeah here to work <laughs> here to move <laughs> how's your mood today i um you know like i've been going through personal transformation for the last couple months or so and i've met i i say this every life i've met the most broken parts of myself and putting my pieces together and i realized that oh broken pieces are not just it's just broken and my old me is dead and then from that old me <laughs> new me is coming up you know emerging and um, i'm here with a better platform better soil and uh, with that uh, more solid core belief about myself so i'm very happy you i'm here and you're here still alive we're still here yes i am happy thank you yes i feel more empowered that's that's the better words to say you know we all go through emotions and Things happen, right, in our life, but um, as Sensei Christopher from Sears Joy uh, says, are you going to be on that rainbow bus or a struggle bus? <laughs> so we are all choosing here with the rainbow bus. I'm from Chicago, Monet, Illinois. Welcome, everybody. How are you from Woming? Is that in China? That's amazing, everybody. Good energy. Thank you for this. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate you. Hi, Aruka. Hi, Ira. Everyone, thank you guys for being here. Let's move our fascia. I'd like to start with, let's move. Let's, let's say, wake up our electromagnetic field, open your feet shoulder width. Let's start tapping into our sensation and feeling because today is a powerful day. How do we manifest? through our heart, through our feelings, rather than the facts, rather than the evidence, or rather than what happened or what you think. <laughs> so really think about our energy and sensation. Hello from Vancouver, hi! Good to see you. Yeah, I live in Vancouver, Canada, where the fashion maneuvers movement started, and but I was originally born and raised in Japan. Okay, let's clap our hands. Go around our body and to cleanse our energy with our frequency of clapping. And let's rub our nails, rub our knuckles. And let's celebrate ourselves. We're here, we're still here standing. <laughs> and let's feel our energy. So let's use this healing power to charge your organs. I like to start with the organ reset. So if you're new to Human Garage, just follow me, your RC. You are so um, very happy you guys are here. <laughs> very happy you guys are here. And let's use your hands like a jumper cable. Take your left hand in the back. All the meridians, all the nerves go through our neck and each organ store particular emotion. They work really hard for us. So we're just gonna charge our organs <laughs> through our neck and our organs and with our intention. So take your right hand and find your belly button. Two inches to the right, two inches down, or one inch down, just find a tight spot. Don't be afraid to pressure in. And once you find some sticky spot, you're gonna use three fingers, pressure in, twist the skin to the right, and this is an ileocecal valve, valves that connect your small intestine and large intestine. So pressure in, let's breathe into our, our sixth breath. Breathe your mouth. Two. Three. Do your nose. Two. 
let go. Three. Very good. Shake your hands. And I forgot to pin myself. That's your left hand, not right. So this is my right hand. And I'll explain more, but let's type my uh, name. My name is Ikue. Sounds like eco-friendly way. Ikue, way. that's my name. <laughs> that's my name. That's my name. And uh, I'm, I'm your fashion maneuvers coach for an hour. So this is my right hand and this is my left hand. And we just work on that iliocecal valve. Let's move up to liver and gallbladder. So we're going to find the corner underneath your rib cage and stick your fingers in. Don't be afraid. We're going to charge your organs and give her, think of like acupuncture. <laughs> so pressure in, twist the skin towards your right and with your mouth, two, three, please repeat out to me. Hello, anger. Hello, resentment. Thank you for being here. I no longer need your reminder. I choose to let go. I'm letting it go now. Breathe your nose. Two. Three. Okay. Okay. I feel lighter. <laughs> Let's feel our energy, sensation. Fascia is inside of your skin, underneath your skin, all over your body. It's your structure, it's your container, it's your matrix, it's your giant spider webs all over your body. Always listening to your thought. It gets compressed when we depressed <laughs> and we put a lot of chemicals in our body and there's a way to unwind this compression of fascia so that you feel good and everything inside have more room to move function functionally okay let's try take your left hand in the back take your right hand move moving into a stomach so find the left hand corner pressure into your center Let's open that stomach area to believing ourselves more. Happy 11 11. <laughs> I'll be saying that throughout the life. Breathe your mouth. Two. Three. Do you know? Two. Three. Very good. We're believing ourselves and trusting the unknown, right? Rather than fearing the unknown. We have choices. We choose to believe in ourselves rather than being scared of it. We can do this. <laughs> Shake it off. Okay, take your left hand in the back, moving on to pancreas. Right hand, belly button, two inches to the left, two inches down. Find some sticky spot again. Trust in the process. Pressure in and move towards the belly button. And uh, as we do six breath, feel free to move around. It's more about tapping into sensation. With your mouth. Two. Three. Through your nose. Two, three, mm, shake it on. How can we celeb celebrate ourselves even when we have symptoms and diagnosis <laughs> or pain? Things are coming up, right? Trust in the process. But dance with your feelings, dance with your emotion, dance with your pain, dance with your sensation, symptoms. It's okay, move your body, move your mind. Okay, let's go into bladder. Bladder stores as fear, we're gonna let that go. Find the pubic bone, just about that. Use your hands like a blade. Take a deep breath in your mouth, inflate yourself, breathe in. As you exhale, pressure into your bladder and slowly lean forward. Feel free to bend your knees, just find some sticky spot. Don't be afraid to stick your fingers in and it's physically you've noticed that your lower back set to open that up with your mouth 
two, three, few notes, two, three, slightly, slowly bring your upper body back, and this time you're going to lean backwards, pull your skin upwards, squeeze your butt cheek, please repeat after me, hello anger, <laughs> Thank you for protecting me. I choose to let you go. I transmute my fear into love with your mouth. Two, three, to your nose. Ah, two, three. Oh. Let it go. <laughs> okay, let's go into kidney. This can give you a lot of energy. Take your left hand in the back, take your right hand, let's grab your ribcage on the right and pull the skin down and lean over to your left and look to the right. And imagine your ribcage, your kidney expand and contract. Let's do sharp three breath through your mouth to activate our kidney. Breathing. Breathe your mouth. Two, three, do you know? Two, three, slowly come up. Mm. I felt the release on the right side on my butt. Mm, I felt good. <laughs> okay, we have one more kidney. Take your right hand in the back, take your left hand, grab your kidney. Pull the skin down. So when I say kidney, it's a ribcage <laughs> around the brow line if you're a woman. And pull the skin down and lean over to your right and look to the left. Let's do sharp three breath for your mouth. Breathing. Now breathe your mouth. Two. Three. Two nose. Two. Let go, three. Very good, slowly come up. Now slide your left hand, feel the bottom of your rib cage. Use your left arm, start pressure <laughs> your body. Find some sticky tender spot. Once you find it, you're gonna lean forward and lean towards the right. Spleen comes up on your left arm. With your mouth. Two, three, two nose, two, three, mm, shake it off. You may feel lightheaded, that's spleens. Let me just change the volume. Spleen always, um, spleen always help us cleanse our blood. And also the emotion that spleen holds is worries. I feel like this little twerk affects the entire body <laughs> and contribute the tightness on my hips. Something that it's like, you know, every time I worry, it's get it kind of like clenched, right? So it's all about awareness and there are ways to release that. Okay, let's go into our thyroid. Take your right hand, stuff on the bottom of your neck and slightly pin the fascia and bring the skin upwards. Take your left hand in the back and slightly assist this elongation. Send some good energy to your thyroid and breathe your mouth. Two, three, to your nose. Two, three. Very good. Let's do some affirmations. I speak my truth, even if it's convenient for my inconvenient for myself and others. And I no longer feel guilty about it. I no longer feel guilty about speaking up. Let it go. Hmm. I felt good. Okay, right hand on your heart, left hand on the top of your head. 
even just so organ reset you know you can do all kinds of other maneuvers but <laughs> this is one of the underrated maneuvers like organ reset and when i first started i literally did not feel a thing i did not know what i was doing <laughs> but uh as i'm going through this healing journey doing this fashion maneuvers more than four years i noticed that you know our organs 10 organs and we you know put up with us so much with our emotions and when we learn to appreciate give some love to our organs organs uh, appreciate us and love us and you feel the release because the little torque of the organs because they are holding emotion to us it's if it's affecting entire body right give some love acupuncture pressure in <laughs> so take your right hand on your heart and left hand on the top of your head this is a powerful maneuver sending the air through our heart and our brain through our heart and our brain let's calm down our nervous system so that our body knows how to heal itself breathing into your hands breathing and out from the mouth two three your nose two three very good please repeat after me hello brain thank you for protecting me but I don't know I don't need this protection anymore please listen to your heart hello heart you're in charge I'm listening to you I'm following you I love myself I accept myself I forgive myself I am safe I am loved I am lovable I am loved I'm abundant you guys can add anything you like just tap into your body today is a powerful day let's program our fascia as usual but today is a program programming day set the intention all is well everything is happening for my favor I give my permission to receive I am opening myself to receive let's do another six breath breathe your mouth two three three nose two three Mm. let's go for a walk patient is key right as we manifest and visualize our dreams and starting our new year new me okay once you kind of integrate that change let's swing your uh, move your wrist in figure eight just move around, move, move, move. This is a great way to calm down your nervous system. <laughs> you may notice that I'm calm down. <laughs> All I have to do is to calm myself down. Okay, let's open your feet shoulder width. Let's swing your arms side to side. So fascia maneuvers are based on the principle, three principles. Fascia like to feel safe. Fascia like to twist. And fascia like to move slowly. <laughs> so this twisty movements are super powerful and this is sway show if you're free to chin things up you can bend your knees if you like you can reach diagonal up it's all about that twist <laughs> also breathing is important because breathing allows the fascia to open up right breathing is life now in fashion maneuvers as we just have experienced we do some uh, breathing from the mouth when you do mouth breathing, we're tackling the lower parts of your body. And when you move, uh, breathe through your nose, you're tackling the upper body. So this is how we differentiate our breathing. But also, uh, a lot of stuff we do based on three, six, nine, and so on, because, um, because, <laughs> 
because those are the power numbers our body likes. You can't hear a thing. Can you guys hear me? I hope you can hear me. You could post on her page. Yeah, so the, all that, uh, this class will be recorded and it's gonna be posted on my uh, account, Ikue Dancer, so please follow me. <laughs> and also, I have a big announcement. I'm going to have a Zoom class. So if you guys are uh, done, I would love to move with you. I'm limited um, the class. Oh, that's great, you can hear me. I'm lim limited the number of student 30 and uh, it's gonna be a very intimate and so that I can answer your questions and I can start creating some little communities. So um, if you like my energy and resonate with me and if you're on the healing journey, if you're ready to up up level your life and if you like a little bit of dance because I'm a dancer <laughs> my my styles are fashion maneuvers I like to do a lot of like octopusy movement and then have fun <laughs> so how are you guys feeling I feel a little lighter so let's do um, okay how what are you feeling let's do let's do uh, the little or um, the head work and into totally twist it. So what we're gonna do is quickly take your right hand, place on your left shoulder, take your left hand and place on your right shoulder. If you wanna cross your leg, go ahead, right leg over your left foot. Take your right hand, you're gonna swipe the palate. If this is one is weird, molar to molar, right to left, let go, right to left. We're gonna do six times. So the reason why is that right side tend to get tighter, so this gets compressed. So what we're gonna do is just sending that fascia to the left, to the left. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do. So take this right um, thumb, try, right to left. Uh, 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 uh. Very good. Now let's try again. This time you're gonna suck your thumb like a baby, and as we increase the pressure of your head to get the better result, bigger re result, you're gonna also move your head with it like this. Try it. Mm. Hmm. 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 And let it go. Oh, let's see. I feel the opening of my back, the neck. Yeah. Just the little things like that will make a huge difference. Okay, take your thumb and you're gonna go into the palette again. And what we're gonna do is move the skin forward and then, then we just open our inner inner jar, move it around, move it around. <laughs> and it's weird, but it works. And, uh, but um, again, if this is, when I first did it for the very first time, I did not feel a thing because I had a lot of compression of fascia. Also, my fascia was dehydrated and it's just like, everything was like, you know, so restricted. But uh, you learn to appreciate it. Your fascia is hydrated, you will notice that huge difference right away. So, let's try it. Ma'a move the skin forward and then just move around. You know, fascia wants to open in 3D and more dimension. <laughs> then go sideways, up and down, diagonal, be your a twisting movement. So let's try. Uh, 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 uh. Let's try breathing. I can breathe better. My shoulders, I feel it in my shoulders. Like my shoulders are more loosened up. It's so funny how this tension, the jaw tension affects your shoulders, right? And then you can like study like, you know, anatomy and it's like, okay, jaw is connected to shoulders, but it's so amazing if you actually work on your body and you feel it in your body. So take this index and follow your upper teeth and hopefully we're gonna hit that corner and once you hit it even if you don't hit it that's okay if this is your first time it may hurt a little be careful if you have long nails you're gonna slowly go in and open and open your uh jaw so let's try go in open ah uh, and move around 
あーあーあーあー I also like to close my elbows and look up だからあーはい、ブリーディングおお、マイアイスがブライダーはい、すごい楽しいはい、次行きましょうはい、次行きましょうはい、次行きましょうはい、次行きましょうはい、次行きましょうはい、次行きましょうはい、次行きましょうはい、次行
Now, more twist the better, but let's allow the body to open rather than forcing. Now, push your tongue to the left cheek, just find a tight spot, breathe through your nose. Two, three, four, five, six, drop your tongue. Now we're going to do three stage breath through your mouth. Breathe in, hold the breath, breathe in more, in more, hold, let's bring your body more to your right and exhale out. Second time, two, three, hold, body to your right, exhale, drop your shoulders, third time, two, three, hold, and half the mouth. Now through your nose, two, three, Four, five, six, very good, slowly come back center, drop your shoulders, turn your head to the right and body to the left. Push your tongue to the right cheek with your nose, two, three, four, Five, six, very good, drop your tongue, three stage breath through your mouth, breathe in, two, three, hold, and out through your mouth, second time, two, three, hold, and out through your mouth. You're doing awesome. Last one, breathing. Two, three, four, and half in the mouth. Now through your nose, half in the mouth. Two, ah, let go. Three, ah, four, five, six. Very good. Breathe your mouth. Now stop moving anywhere you like. You can lean backwards, lift one shoulder up, or lean forward. This is a free movement. You don't have to copy me. Let your body guide you. More twists the better. We all have a sticky place, right? When you find a sticky place, let's keep breathing. You can choose to breathe through your mouth or your nose. And let's see if we can relax some of the area that is sticky and enjoy this twisty movement, enjoy this moving meditation and breathe. Also, my favorite is uh, moving my elbows up. It's awesome for my shoulders. Take your time. There's nothing to, you know, we no need to rush. Remember, uh, you can also uncross your legs to try. Keep on moving. Keep on finding some sticky spot. Oh. Body, I appreciate you <laughs> for stretching and twisting it. And you're gonna even go squat. Oh. There's always the sticky spot. <laughs> Let's see if we can release some of that. Ah. And let it go. Relax, shake your hands, and go for a walk. 
<laughs> I do this type of uh, moving meditation, fashion maneuvers uh, in my own practice. But um, if you guys who live in Vancouver area, um, when I do group classes, I take a lot of time and let people just move around and explore their body. Super powerful because, you know, we all have a pattern. <laughs> we all have torque pattern. And that torque pattern got us where we are in order for us to release what no, no, no longer serves us is, is basically you have to dig deeper, right? And being consistent with yourself and showing up for yourself, right? It's easy to start something, but consistency is key. And, um, and then as we continue to show up for yourself and you continue to improve, <laughs> that's how I feel with fashion maneuvers. I've been doing this over four years and it has changed my life. But I'm also, I am also learning my body. Uh, my life is not perfect. My body is not perfect either, but also I'm learning through this, you know, being patient with myself and be patient with my progress. So if you're feeling like that, you're not alone and things do come up as we, releasing and going to this new timeline and today is a happy happy 11 11 super powerful day don't forget to write down your dreams <laughs> in category you know your home environment your career your relationships like all kinds of relationships could be romantic family um, work relationships and your finance and your hobby passion and your legacy all of that is a powerful day to set the intentions okay so let's try the other side take your left hand and place underneath your right armpit take your right hand and place on your left shoulder hug yourself like you most you are the most important thing in the whole world and if you understand the illusion everything is a hologram <laughs> you understand that you're the only one that exists in this world it's all up to us everything is up to us sometimes it's very hard to see that but everything is up to us okay take your uh cross your left foot over your right foot feel free to readjust however you like find your belly button squeeze your belly button into your spine and put out your sexual organs so you have a good center now turn your head to the right and body to the left allow your body to open push your tongue to the right cheek with your nose two three four, five, six, very good, drop your tongue, three stage breath, your mouth breathing, two, three, oh, and off and second time, two, three, oh, and off and Third time, two, three, four, and half from the mouth. Through your nose, ah, let go, two, three, four, five, six. Very good, slowly come back center. Turn your head to the left and body to the right. Push your tongue to the left cheek with your nose. Two, three, four, five, six. Very good, drop your tongue with your mouth. Two, three, hold, and off the mat. Second time. Two, three, hold, and off the mat. Third time. Two, three, hold, and off the mat. Now through your nose. Off the mat. Two, ah, let go. Three, four, five, six. 
Very good. Now time for moving meditation. Breathe your mouth. Go anywhere you feel. You can also uncross your legs. Just let your body guide you where you want to go. Or you can stay there when you find a sticky spot. Tell your body you're safe and protected. You're loved. It's okay. It's safe for you to relax. Ah, let it go. Your body relaxes with the exhale. So, ah, let it go. It's all good. You're safe to let go. Sometimes we have a fear of letting it go. It's like, no, I want to manifest this. I can't let go. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> Once you let go, everything is uh, meant to fall into place and it's very hard to get there. <laughs> Let's trust the process. Let it, letting it go is a safe thing to do. Once you're ready, ready, let it go. I feel a lot calmer and I feel a little lightheaded. <laughs> Let's go for a walk. Hi. Thank you guys for being here on this powerful day. Happy 11 11. So, I decided to have a fascial maneuver class on Zoom. It's uh, coming up Saturday, November 23rd, 1 p.m. PST. If you guys are interested, please follow me. I, um, I already announced it. <laughs> and it's going to be a powerful day. I limited the number of students to 30 so that we can create some intimate, um, intimate class. And I, I'll be answering questions. Yes, 11 11. Yes, super powerful. Loving this 11 11. Me too. Good. it's a powerful day okay give yourself a little shake uh, before we get into a different maneuver okay say so pulse do to to poor connection I hope you guys can hear me um, you're gonna grab so use your hands and let's open our lower back so um, grab your waist and what you're gonna do is push your um, use your four fingers as a leverage and then you're gonna use your left thumb and your right thumb and move your skin forward there's no right or wrong you just have to keep moving and if you feel like you can lean forward feel free to bend your knees and move it around and it's all about ex ex expanding your fascia yes let's go for uh six breath breathing two Three, do your nose, two, three, let's go six more breath, breathing, send a lot of air to your lower back, three, do your nose, two, three, so what you can do is you can try arching your back and move the skin upwards or you can even contract and tuck your tailbone under and if you felt it more you can choose and you can do both definitely yeah, I feel my right side is really tight so I'm just like keep adjusting it's all about feeling your body and you take care of your body okay let it go <laughs> Ah, feel that contrast. Hope you guys feeling lighter. Okay, so 444 four, four right now, super powerful <laughs> in 11 11. So let's try this belly button torque. We can't forget this belly button on this powerful day 11 11. So, belly button is um, we used to be connected with our mothers, right? Unbiblical course. Uh, by the way, I was born by C section 
and when I was born I was told that um, biblical cord was wrapped around my neck and I was temporarily not breathing so <laughs> on my birth note it says I was resuscitated and that's such a strong word but anyway that's part of my journey and then um, but so when I do belly button I think about that and um, it's super powerful to unwind because all that information were passed down through our mother and good ones and not so good ones and we we are all here to break that generational trauma here right <laughs> so what we're gonna do is take this hands and use your hands and pressure into your belly button which is kind of weird but torque and torque the skin towards the right so counterclockwise towards your right shoulder now you can just try this, but also you can take this left hand in the back and find the opposite side of your belly button and you can torque the skin counter-rotate. So right hand to your right shoulder, left hand to your left shoulder. And then let's, um, while pin, the, pin these two spots, let's start moving around however you want. You can bend your knees, you can do a little circle, Feel your body, breathe your mouth. Two, three, through your nose. Two, three. Let's do six more breath, breathing. Two, three, through your nose. Two, three, and let it go. Hmm. My mind calmed down. It's like it got quiet <laughs> quite fast. Let's go for more. Hmm. Do you guys feel that? <laughs> Belly button torque is super powerful. Okay. I feel like going on the floor. Let me adjust the camera quickly. If you guys are done, let's go on the floor or do you can do it um, on a chair, whatever works for you. But if you just quickly work on our legs, give yourself a little shake. And if you can't really see because of the letters, you can tap the middle of the screen so that you can bring down the, uh, the letters and people are joining, <laughs> if that helps. So let's uh, start with your right, right leg. So if you grow, grow, grew up doing snake bite, that's what we're gonna do. You're gonna snake bite however you want. There's no right or wrong way to do this. You just pin the fascia, you twist it, maybe move the skin towards you and push your foot away from you and then start moving your foot in every direction. You can also kind of like, yeah, a lot of people do different things it just have to you just have to pin the fascia and move it around and breathe very good and you can slightly swing um move your skin move your hands towards your shin and your calf just keep moving, keep finding some good sticky spot. Very good. You can also work on the hamstrings. You can interlock your hands and move the skin towards you. Then just move it around. This is part of leg release. Gary likes to call it barefoot sprinter number two. <laughs> okay, shake your hands, shake your legs. Very quick one, because I want to do a little bit of a different maneuvers. So let's walk on the left leg. Same thing, you're going to snake bite and pressure in and start moving your foot in any direction that feels good. However you want. And as I'm breathing, I'm setting the intention to send the air to my skin above my ankle. <laughs> It's all about bringing back movement and flow into your body. There's no right or wrong, but to feel your body 
and tell your body that you're safe and protected. Thank you for all you do. And let's work together. Let's move together. Let's release what no longer serves us. You know, we are ascending. <laughs> we have to take our body with us. Let's cross your hands because you have to take your body with us. Otherwise, you can't ascend. Body is, as long as we are on earth, our body is part of us, right? This is our sacred temple. Okay. Shake, shake, shake. So quickly, what I like to do is to show you guys what's possible. So functional maneuvers, we do have basic maneuvers, but at the end of it, it's really loud. <laughs> you can make everything fashion maneuvers as long as you add some twists. So let's uh, place your right foot against around your knees, just like a normal stretch. And if you, this is hard, just try your best. Just like do what you can. Squeeze your belly button into your spine. Take this right hand and try to touch the toes. If you're not, just touch anywhere you can. And grab and then stretch your um, hamstrings on your left as you do that. You can take this left hand, wrap it around and go like that. <laughs> now, rotate your torso to the left and turn your head to the right. Breathe your mouth. Two. Three. Do you know? Two, three. I also like to rock my body like this, side to side, adding more contrast. There is no right or wrong, so keep just rocking and keep twisting. Very good. Ooh. Once you're ready, let it go. From here, let's bring this foot in so you can stretch this way. So this one, I feel like um, I can go, there's so many things you can do. Let's see, you can go like that. But let's take this left hand and touch your knees or your hamstring um, calf area. And then you twist your torso to the right and keep finding some good steady spot. Spine up heavy locking, turn your head to the left, we'll add some twists, breathe your mouth. Two, three, two notes, two, three, very good, shake your body, ah. okay, let's try the other side, take this left foot and going to pass it if you've done any ballet, but just make a triangle like a tree in yoga pose. My left leg needs a little more love, <laughs> so I would just shake my legs a little bit more so that there's the initial shock, there's a tension here. So I'm just like rocking, tell my body that she's safe and protected, it's safe for her to let go. Now take this left hand, if you can touch your legs or your toes, whatever works for you. From here, take this right hand if you like and wrap it around. I'm just going like this and palms up and almost like letting my fingers touch. Now, rotate my toes to the right and head to the left. Breathe your mouth. Two. Three. Two nose. Two. Three. Let's have some rocking sensation. Lots of twists is good. Oh, I hear a lot of ambulance today. That's crazy. Okay, shake it off. Let's bring this left foot and fold it. Spinal pivot locking. Take this right hand. Must touch your left knee around the knee area. You're gonna Rotate your toes to the left and turn your head to the right. Just keep finding some steady spot. You can rock your body. Breathe your mouth. Two. Three. Two nose. Two. Three. 
Very good. Slowly unwind. Give yourself a little shake. And once you're ready, let's come up and feel our brand new legs and hips. Yeah. Yes. How are you guys feeling? We're almost done. Thank you guys for being here. Oops. Okay, I'm on two platforms. One is from uh, my account and one is from Human Garage. Um, Mm -mm -mm. or you can place and sign in the chat bar don't send it the comments would temporarily disappear yeah so when you tap it you can bring them the comments so you can see yeah yeah <laughs> you can make anything on fashion maneuvers with a little twist yeah exactly that's that's uh, that's the secret <laughs> anyway yeah yeah how you feel Ooh, i feel good okay we have five more minutes. Can you save this live? Yeah, this live will be recorded and it will be posted on my account. So if you guys are interested, please follow me. Also, I'm having a Zoom class on November 23rd. And um, um, please sign up. <laughs> I would love to see you there. And so you can get a little bit of intimate uh, class and i'll watch you guys and make sure you're doing it right but also there's no right or wrong <laughs> i said like <laughs> november 30 zoom class i would love to see you there you can find the information on my account uh it's a link in the bio if you guys are interested i'm just going to type but i'm having a hard time typing <laughs> do you guys have any questions what's your intention of today um, we are moving fascia together. There's a lot of power moving together, right? And pin the comment. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. So let's, um, uh, finish with a little shake. <laughs> you know what I started to do is this is another embedded maneuvers that I've started to do. I'm noticing a tightness on my hips and this has been really helping me. So we've done some bladder reset right here, right? So pubic bones and up. And there's this line and psoas that goes here. And I, I finding myself like psoas gets uh, tight. And so what I'm going to do is put my weight close to the ball of my feet so that um, my weight is in the front rather than on my heels. My, and then while I'm here, I'm just going to keep bouncing. And as I'm bouncing, instead of folding my body, I am pulling my, basically pull my belly buttons into your spine, finding the center. And with my hands assist, I am going to dig deeper and pull the skin upper. So let's try. <laughs> we just keep bouncing and as you do this for a while you feel the opening of your back and I also feel that cooling sensation and release on my legs so there's no right or wrong you can sort of like play around but I found that it's very profound you can breathe you just have to shake it up <laughs> right and keep finding some sticky spot. Choose to elongate, choose to let go. Whew. Let's do 30 more seconds, breathing. this belly button uterus all of that right area it gets sticky and tight I'm just shaking that off <laughs> okay let's go for a walk awesome I feel a lot lighter so this is the end of the class hope you guys had a great time um, 
I am a fashion maneuvers coach. My name is Ikwe. I teach people how to heal themselves, but uh, bring back a lot of joy and flow into their life and uh, body and the face. And uh, fashion maneuvers changed my life. My body has changed my body, my face and outlook on life. Very happy that you guys are here and uh, um, helping yourself and joining me because there's a power in moving together. It was fun. Yeah. It was fun too and most importantly I am doing this for myself to help myself heal so that I can create uh, the beautiful life <laughs> we all have power to heal ourselves and thank you so much yeah I really appreciate you guys for commenting and you can you can watch this re reply replay on my account so please make sure you follow and I would love to see you guys on my um, November 23rd zoom class you can sign up from the link in my bio and um, yes <laughs> let's create a beautiful community together and this class is every Monday at um, 4 p.m. PST <laughs> and when we uh, have Instagram live you can just casually watch but also uh, if you could move with me that's all be amazing oh thank you guys for commenting like crazy I love that New Zealand yeah thank you thank you for being here for a couple of minutes I feel so much better oh that's awesome yeah a little bit of something every day right but fascia has power you know remember to um, hydrate our fascia and move your fascia that's our consistency and uh, it will change your life um, over time one step at a time and happy 11 11 today is is a very powerful day make sure you take some time for yourself maybe put on the like, nice candles essential oils celebrate how far you've come and uh, forgive all the past experiences that you are not happy with <laughs> forgive yourself and forgive all your mistakes and forgive all the people <laughs> that have done harm onto you and we you can we can release uh, release them right we have we should have power we don't want to take bad energy into next uh, next next uh year total body involvement including back and photo you accomplish what is that accomplish a lot with uh <laughs> my lazy body yes <laughs> good energy yes yeah super powerful thank you guys for being here i'm gonna go have a great rest of your day Happy 11-11, let's celebrate our New Year's and I'll see you guys next Monday. Or um, if you guys are interested, I am showing up every day uh, around 9 o'clock p.m. to do some uh, uh, moving meditation, like speaking meditation. <laughs> so if you guys in uh, could join, that would be awesome. I forgive everyone for everything and ask everyone to forgive me for everything. Exactly, right? Let's forgive our past and let's forgive ourselves for our mistakes. We just didn't know. Also forgive other people for harming us. We, they just didn't know. We also didn't have good boundaries, right? But now in this Scorpio season, we learned to set a strong boundary for ourselves. And we know we upgraded and uh, reinforced our boundaries so that we can show up to the world with with a brand new brand new core belief about who we are and uh yes <laughs> okay bye guys everyone i'll see you uh, in my account bye happy 11 11